So if anybody joins in late or anything, they will get the, the this will be recorded and posted up later. So, so here is block number six. There's our pretty block. So this is our main part that we're sewing. We do have a little bit of applique again. This time we're doing triangles as opposed to circles. And then we are just doing a little rectangle for our other accent border. So this one I thought came together fairly quickly, not too bad. There is one, I know, correction for your um, pattern on page 22. Down here on the bottom for the piecing instructions on the um, accent strips, where it says lay out one background two, they actually meant to say background three. So that it should read lay out one background three C and it should be rectangles because they're not squares. And that's the only correction that you need for your book. Everything else in the pattern for this month is correct. If you cut everything via the cutting diagram, you'll have more than enough fabric. So we're making a couple, we're doing a lot of half square triangles this month. And we're doing a lot of um, flying geese this month. So the half square triangles, we're doing the two at a time, like most quilting patterns we do. The flying geese, I will remind you when you go to sew those, to sew not directly on the line that you draw, just one thread over. So you have enough when you go to fold it, when you go to press it back then you'll have plenty and you won't lose your points then. My only thing that I did different than what he said in the instructions is you sew that this block into quadrants. So this is one quadrant here. This is another quad quadrant. When I piece those together, since I had my half square triangles here, I sewed when I pressed those, I press those quadrants open so I could get a flatter seam. He tells you to press them to one side and I pressed mine open. And that was a personal preference because I wanted this to be flat and I didn't want that bump right here in the middle. But I found that that worked the best. It didn't, um, then I eliminated that bump when you go to do the quilting at a later date. And that was really about all. I pretty much, I followed everything else. There were, I think I did press this one seam here open too. Just because I had, you're having two um, flying geese meet up right here in this point. So I pressed that seam open. I tend to, I don't necessarily always follow what the pressing instructions tell me. I will see how it's coming together and how I need it to lay flat when I'm done. So if I'm sewing something together and I'm like, ooh, that's gonna be, that's gonna give me like this big hump right here. That's when I decided I'm gonna press that open. But everything else I pressed to the dark side or close or to one side or the other, but there were a few that I did press open. So feel free. If you're not liking how it's laying, press those seams open if you feel the need to press them open, okay? I don't think, I think we're good. All right, then we have our triangles and your pattern to trace out your triangle is on page 23. This is the triangle that you're going to use to trace and get your applique for your triangle. I just took I just took my ruler and I drew my lines and I and that's how I got it nice and perfectly straight cuz this I I didn't find a template or anything that was quite this triangle. So I just took my ruler and was just copying it underneath but just drawing with my ruler to get it just the way I wanted. 
and I did seam and seam on the back of my triangles. And then I did use that lightweight um, stabilizer underneath when I went to sew my, when I went to applique it down. So I didn't get any puckering or anything like that. So my seams are, my stitching is nice and crisp and precise. But though that really was about, those are my tips and tricks for this block. Does anybody have questions about this block or really any other block that we had? Nope, you're doing good, Ginny. <laughs> Do you remember I called you that one day? Yes. I did it, I forgot, I did it already. Oh, nice, yay! Look at that, perfect. So anyway. <laughs> everything that everything that you say is true. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Good. Wonderful, Shirley. Are you keeping up, Shirley? I'm ahead of the game, I guess. <laughs> All right. Awesome. Just you'll be ready when block seven, when we ship out block seven, you'll be ready to go. I will be. I will be. <laughs> How are you doing so far, Ginny? I'm a couple of months behind, but I'm doing okay. Okay, that's good. Because <laughs> he's sewing other things, you know. Well, you know, that does happen. <laughs> yep. You get busy doing all the other stuff. I, I'm caught up with the shop blocks, but my own personal ones, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm a couple of blocks behind now. <laughs> but that's the way it goes. So, eh, oh, well, yep. I'll get caught up after the summer's done. <laughs> Sounds familiar. Yeah. <laughs> Do you have any questions, Diane? <laughs> Doesn't want to unmute on ya? <laughs> no, oh darn. <laughs> All right, well. <laughs> Yeah. This was this was an easy this was a fairly easy one so it, I I thought this one was it's pretty straightforward once you start getting once you start getting going so yeah I didn't I didn't think it was the first few were a little more felt complicated but the last few have been kind of nice yeah this one doesn't look like it's going to be too bad. No, I think I I managed to get the cutting all done and the sewing all done in one one evening. So it wasn't it didn't take very long at all. So the the one Jeez. part where I had to do over was yeah right in here to get my lines. Oh, to get that line to line up, up to be yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so you know that was about the only thing that that was I about the only thing. Yeah, I know. This one, when I started making it, I'm like, oh, well, this is not, this actually isn't that bad. So, and then I, awesome. I figure that good quilting will cover up some of my mistakes. So, oh, yeah, any quilting that'll just cover up any little minor mistakes. Nobody will notice it. <laughs> <laughs> Nobody will pay attention. All right. Well, if nobody else has any questions, I think we're all set for this month and we'll see you again next month. Sounds good. Good to all go. All right. Thanks, well, Jess. You're welcome. Well, you guys have a good rest of your day. Enjoy your Saturday. You all right. Bye. Bye.